Michelle Gillerney seems to think that you have done a silent deal with the Ulster Unionist Party, have you? Definitely not. No one, not one political party has ever come to talk to me. Uh, I am standing on my own two feet. I will represent everybody here and I I refute any allegations that uh, any political party came to talk to me. Some say that you're just a token candidate and are here to simply make up the numbers. Is that correct? No, definitely not. Uh, I, From day one I have said that I will um, do my best to win the seat and uh, definitely, definitely not. Arlene Foster told me on Friday that she sees this as a two-horse race between Tom Elliott and Michelle Gilderney. What are your thoughts on that? I like horse racing and always that the uh, the outside rank outsider has always the chance of winning. I have a very positive uh, outlook that uh, you know I can win with the help of uh, the people um, to you know line in behind me and give me their support. Give me a percentage. Uh, well, it's hard to put a figure on it, but twenty percent, fifty percent, seventy percent, hundred percent confident. Well, I'm 100% confident. That you're going to win? Yeah. 100%? Yeah, well, I'm. Uh, if uh, there's not much point in me going to a door and asking somebody for their vote when I don't, when I don't believe in myself, I, uh, like I'm just going to, I will present myself to everybody. I don't uh, offend anybody, and I, rep- you know, I will represent everybody. Last week, Alex Atwood didn't even know you'd been selected. Was that embarrassing? No, not really. Everybody's really? Talking, everybody's talking about me now. So well, it's, he didn't uh, even know you'd sel- been selected. Does that not uh, would that alarm you? Not worry you? No, it's the it's the people of Manus South Tyrone that needs to know who I am. It just shows that um, maybe people west of the ban need to realise that there is you know or east of the ban that uh, there is people living west of the ban. Does that include Mr. Atwood? Yeah. So he needs to realise that you're here too. Yeah, but uh, we're not. Uh, we're not going to. Uh, when, I, when I get elected, we will not be uh, neglected anymore. Because I will be a strong voice for the people of Fermanagh South Tyrone. Was that a blunder by Alex Atwood? No, I don't. Uh, don't think so. But it just. Uh, it's got. It's raised my profile. So I'm happy. But has it raised your profile in a positive way? Uh, well, well, everybody knows who my, what my name is now, so it gives me the chance of being, uh, you know, forward in my situation.